An Indian Army contingent has departed for Alaska to participate in the 21st edition of the India-US Joint Military Exercise 2025. For a notam issued for 2nd and 3rd September, the Indian Air Force and Indian Navy have launched a large-scale long-range anti-shipping and maritime strike exercise in the Northern Arabian Sea, just 70 nautical miles from Pakistan-controlled airspace. The drills focus on simulated strikes against enemy warships, naval shipyards, docks, ports, onshore facilities and fuel depots, sending a clear strategic message to India's adversaries. The leader of North Korea Kim Jong-un is traveling to China to join a military parade with Chinese and Russian leaders in a show of unity against the US. The Russian Navy and Chinese Navy have conducted their first joint underwater submarine patrol in the Sea of Japan and East China Sea. India has blocked Azerbaijan's bid for full membership in the Shanghai Cooperation Organization. General Atomics has conducted first flight of its YFQ-42A prototype in California, which has been offered to Indian Air Force by General Atomics. Asok Leyland has entered into a long-term exclusive partnership with China's Calbee Group to invest 5,000 crore rupees in battery manufacturing in India with a localized battery supply chain. US-based Shield AI has showcased its cutting-edge hive mind artificial intelligence autonomy software during trials with the Indian Army in Himachal Pradesh. Bangalore-based Axis Caves has bagged a 150 crore rupees order from the DRDO to develop 10 electronic control units for the Su-30 aircraft cooling system upgrade. The prototype order is expected to be followed by a production run of 600 units over the next five years. Adani Defense has confirmed its participation in the AMCA program, and the CEO of Adani Defense has said that the company will submit its bid by 30th September. Hell has begun metal cutting and fabrication for the 300 km range Katz Hunter air-launched cruise missile. Carriage trials are planned for mid-2026, developmental trials in 2027, and production by 2030. It is to be noted, that HAL showcased the Katz Hunter concept in 2021, which clearly reflects India's characteristically long research and development cycles, where transforming a concept into a fielded system often takes at least a decade. The GTRE has confirmed that India's upcoming 120 kN class indigenous jet engine for the AMCA Mark II will feature 3D thrust vectoring nozzles developed entirely in India, that will enable super maneuverability reduced turn radius, enhanced survivability, improved takeoff and landing performance, increased weapon employment envelope, and better energy management in within visual range combat. Russia has announced that it is conducting feasibility studies to evaluate investment needs for manufacturing the Su-57 fifth generation stealth fighter jets in India. Russia aims to leverage India's existing manufacturing base at Hal's Nashik facility, which is being considered as a potential site for Su-57 assembly, significantly reducing costs and timelines. Russian agencies are examining both financial and logistical frameworks, while other Indian facilities already engaged in producing Russian origin equipment may also support the program, that would align with India's self-reliance drive and enhance cost efficiency through localized production. Today's Top 3 Comments Oh, Mark, drop it.